Okay, so hi, so uh, my name is Matos and I'd like to uh, make you aware of uh, performance ceiling tests. Today I've pushed uh, commit to master which should help you to create some. So, uh, why? Uh, we already have a Tinder box running <coughs> some tests, but it just loads and saves documents. Uh, which is probably the most important thing you want to test, but in some cases you may want to test also uh, other functions like, like I don't know, mail merge stuff or anything. So, mm. uh, okay, so uh, how to make sure your feature stays fast. So, uh, you, you have some feature you want uh, to... you want to... Uh, make sure it's fast, so, so you, you improve it and you create the unit tests and then revert any commit breaking it. Or maybe even better, you first create the unit tests and and then, uh, then you can improve it and watch uh, how much is better. Like uh, this commit saved 10%, so uh, you can watch that. Some so some basics. Uh, in make file, you want to call set performance test macro and. In source file, you include call grind header and use some of macros to tell it when the code is running you want to test, and then you will get uh, you will get the number of instructions. Okay. And there, there, there is also example commit in Gerrit for uh, auto correction stuff. It's it's still in Gerrit because it's it, it's not doing what what I would like it to do. But yeah, you can you can have a look how to create unit test. Um, what do you need? Uh, we already had uh, enable volgrind variable, which is true if you have Volgrind headers installed in your system. So you, you just make sure it's true and you can, well, not, not make, uh, there is a perf check target. Uh, so it's... Uh, So it's still not clear what to do with the unit tests. Uh, right now, they, uh, they, well, you set the number of instructions there, and uh, if it runs longer, it, it just fails. But this is probably not what we want. It's, it may be annoying, like sometimes, mm, the, Sometimes it's just necessary that something takes longer, like recently loading empty writer documents is slower because there is sidebar uh, by default. So that, there may be some reasons why it's slower. So we probably don't want to just fail, but I, uh, I don't know, maybe create, create some tables and uh, and watch the numbers. Okay, so basically that's all. It's simple to create such unit test. I encourage you to to create one and yeah. That, that, yeah thanks. Thirty seconds for questions. If anybody has. Yes. If it is, it's um, 
some kind of amount slower than, than, than the last time that it referenced. Yes, so yes. How much slower is it currently? Uh, currently just one person, but... Okay. Yeah. Yeah, th th these pilots, I, I'm not sure what we should do with the results now, but yeah. Cool, very fast, extremely flat. So yeah. 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 Yeah.